Hey everyone, it's Jay again. So, for any of you who've been following, you know that I'm now doing a weekly painting challenge. This week, I challenged myself to paint a 10-man paladin squad. And seeing as it took me about 4 or 5 weeks on and off to paint the previous squad, you know the problem that I'm in. There is a good chance that I'm in way over my head. Today is Thursday. That means that I'm halfway done my painting challenge. Therefore, I've decided to do a quick video showing you guys my progress over the last three days and showing what I need to finish for the next three days. So that brings us to the question, what do these models look like now? How much progress have I made this week? So, just a refresher, this is what the first half of the Paladin Squad looked like at the beginning of my challenge. As you can see, they're on their way, but they still need a lot of work. Now here is a picture of what they look like as of today. As you can see, I was able to finish up all the force weapons and their arms and attach them obviously. I also finished up their side cannons um, and worked on the browns and the reds. The only thing I have left for this squad are the golds and then the fine details like the black hilts and stuff, but that shouldn't take me very long. What about the other half of the squad? As you can see here, the other half of my 10-man squad hadn't even been assembled yet at the beginning of my challenge. Therefore, I knew my week would be a very busy one. However, as you can see by this photo, I've actually gotten a lot of work done on them. I spent most of Monday assembling them, and then Tuesday and Wednesday painting up the silvers, the browns, and the reds on each model. So far, I think they look pretty sweet. Uh, as you can see, I've gotten pretty far on them, given my only three days. I've even painted up their force weapons. As with the other squad, I still have to finish the golds and then the minor details, like their eyes and uh, the black colors on, on their weapons and such. Here is a zoom in shot of the Psy Cannons. As I said, all my Psy Cannons are magnetized, so you can switch them out for all the other heavy weapons. And here is a photo of my last Psy Cannon guy, who will also have a Demon Hammer. Lastly, here is the banner guy. I think it's going to take me at least a day just to paint that banner alone. So that's it. I will be posting a video later in the week showing the finished progress of my weekly challenge. So, I'd like to thank you all very much like, once again for watching my videos. As always, feel free to subscribe to my videos and leave comments below. Feel free to subscribe to my blog at paintingwithj.blogspot.com where I will also be updating my progress throughout the week and posting more tutorials, reviews, and videos. And then as I've said in my previous videos, painting should be fun. So take your time, enjoy yourself, and have fun.